G'day and welcome back to Dark Solo Gaming and our Let's Play series on Satisfactory. Okay, let me just get to the edge here. What we have decided to do, we uh, had a bit of an issue with the recording of the last episode in relation to the fact that uh, he just wouldn't let us build anything for some reason. So we've, we've reset and we've got that up and working. Now, we did talk about getting distribution of our steel production over there on that escarpment going down over through the back over there. Uh, of our steel pipes and steel beams back over to our main base area, which is way over there. Now, we've been and had a look at where we're expanding everything, and we've done a couple of changes in there, and we're going to have that up and running. Um, but what we've decided to do is we need to get all our materials over there. Now, we did look at using the tractor to take them all over there and all that sort of stuff. The problem with doing that is sorting it all out but we're not going to do that. So we're going to run conveyor belts. We're going to do the spaghetti junctions. So we have just started building our spaghetti junction out through there. So we started off over there near our concrete plants, which are hardly being used. So they're all ready to go. They're going to feed back over into there as well. Uh, we have a feed over here from our reinforced steel that's being produced over in that section there. And then we're going to bring our steel production stuff from over the back over there in through there and join up with this conveyor stacks through there and they will go through there as well. Now, one of the things we had forgotten that we did off camera at one point, you can see here we've got a whole pile of coal going this way as well. Uh, we produced a steel production facility here as well. So in here, we've actually already got steel pipes and steel beams being produced. Um, is that a bad thing? Well, no, not really, but we... Um, we didn't realize that we had this already running and forgot about it. So, yeah, that's a bit of a bonus. So, what we are going to do, we're going to tie these ones in, obviously, with all this over here. And that's that's not a big issue, but what we need to do is set it all up. So, what we're going to first do is we're going to set this part up here. And so, what we're going to do is go up here. We're going to add another two levels on top here, like that. Now... We're going to come over here and set up our levels here. So we're going to put that there. Now, they are at a level of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so 7 and 8. So, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Now, I'm going to go to 6. Reason being, we need to make sure we've got a reasonable height going up so we're going to go to there and we're going to go from there to ah that'll be right we're a bit short okay so we're going to come out to here and we're just going to go well is that going to work ah oh, just enough clearance that works all right so we've got beams and pipes heading up to that part of the conveyor. So, now, we're going to continue on with that. So we're going to take conveyor from there. In fact, let's do the top first. So you just do the top. So we're going to take from the top to there, to that one, there. From that one there, to that one, there. Come over here we add another two levels onto here and this is what we do so we do this all the way over the map there and there and we're going to go there into there and there to there he's going to go from there down to there and from there there all right and then he is going to go there to there and one more level here and then he's going to go another level from there to there now over here we're going to have to do something a little bit different now we are going to set that up though this is going to be where those belts will go across but what we're going to do is we're going to put a merger. Now, I've got to make sure we do this right. Because this could be catastrophic. So, what we're going to do is we're going to leave them there for now. Um, because I may have to switch them over. They may go top and tail. All I have to remember is that pipes are on the bottom, beams are on the top. 
So the opposite for B, B and B, we'll do that. Anyway, I think we can set that up now. We'll be all right. So let's get that over to there. So we're going to do a merger. Yeah, put a merger there and a merger there. Look how much better they sync in now. Well, they used to. All right. So we are then going to go from there. No, no, no. Right. So we still have that problem. Okay. Let's see if we can do this. So we're going to go four. We're going to go from there to there. Right. That does that nicely. We're then going to go uh, a merger. So I think we still going to have to do the same as what we did previously. And that is set them up from top to bottom. And then we go from there into there. And there we go. So that works. So now what we'll see, you get up here a little bit higher, they'll come across, they'll hit the merger, and then they'll start heading down that way. Now, what's on that top rail? Oh, that is that is the, the beams. That's okay. So the beams are there. And the pipes will see, see coming down through there. And off they go. So they're, they're on their way. So then we've got three lines there ready to go, which need to go over to the main base. All right. So that's got all that section over there sorted out. And there's our spaghetti. Look at that. Looks wonderful. Maybe not, but anyway. And from here, we need to continue this on and over to our production facility, which is over the back, not there, over the back where? Now, we're going to get lost again, aren't we? Let's make sure we're going the right direction. Uh, it's over that way, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it was that way. All right, let's, let's get the tractor and have a look. There it is. Yeah, it's over there. It's over there. So what we're going to do is we're going to scope out where we're going to go. So I think if we go straight up through there, that will probably work. So that'll do. So what we're going to do is we're going to put these levels in here. So we're going to go turn that around. And to... Gonna give it a bit of height just to make sure we're gonna have clearance there. I'll uh, we'll go one more. Right. And then we're just gonna run down through here a little bit. Again, give it up. Oh, went the wrong place. Bit like that. And put another one in to about there should be sufficient. Three, four, five, six. Probably going a little bit overboard with the height, but that's okay. Now, we want to go, I want to make sure we got this set up correctly. So we're going to go from there into there. And then we want to go from here. I don't think it's going to be quite close enough. And it's not. So we need to put some more in here. So six, one, two, three, four, five, and six. So now he's going to go from there, whoops, there, up to the top one here, and then across to there. And then he's going to go from that one there, to there and into there right so that's going to be how that's going to merge in through there all right all tickety boo now continue on now a lot of this is going to be quite boring so we'll probably end up just uh finishing all of this off camera i think we'll we'll go off and do something else in a second um and we're a bit short again. It'd be nice if we had a some way of measuring how far exactly we can go out. That's six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Come out to there. Goes to there. And he goes across. 
across to there. Into there. Alright. And the last link for here is to go from there to there. Alright. So we're getting closer. Now it's getting dark. So we are going to head on over here. So the other thing is, as we found out in the last episode, um, doing it this way is a hell of a lot safer than me driving because, or setting up a route, because last time we almost lost our tractor. So we can't go that way, so we're going to have to go up around here to the right. Can't go up through there, so we're going to have to go around and up through here. Must come back and get that slug a little bit later. Another slug up there as well. And then just around in here, there's a nice copper ore vein. So we are there. This is where we're coming through. Now, problem with this is we've got these nasty pieces through here and we've got that chasm, which is what we almost fell through. So we are going to have to do this a little bit more carefully. So I don't know if we can reach quite over. Can we reach? Yeah, we can reach there. So we're going to go one. Two. We're going to go one. Do this side because it's just easy to do. Three, four, five will be enough on this side. Yeah. Right. Now we're going to go from the outside to there. Oh, we haven't got enough. Bugger. Bugger, bugger, bugger. All right. That's not quite going to work. So, what we'll do is we'll pull them down. Like so. I need to be a little bit closer, so we're going to put them over here. Like so. Two, three, four, five. Now we're going to go from the top one here. And do it without falling down. There, there, like so, and from there, I think that's the right one. To there. All right, that's got that part going. All right. So, then that's going to continue up this way. So what we're going to do is we're going to just do this bit of a cheat. So we're going to go up here. Right, so we need to put it about here. Right, two, three, four, five. Conveyor across to there. There. To there. All right, getting closer. Leave the tractor there. So again, we're just going to go across here and see where it's going to stop. And it will stop just short of that. It's a bit of a bugger, but that's okay. So again, two, oh, right. We're out of iron rods and iron plate. Okay. So while we're here, let's just go over here and we will demolish the transport area. We don't need that. Now, uh, we also don't need any of this because this is going to come out totally different. Right. So, that's still producing, so that's okay. Now, let's see how much we've got in there. Yeah, building up slowly but nicely. All right. 
So what we need to do is we need to head back and get some basic materials again so we can continue this on and that will be okay. All right, so what else do we need to do? Well, we need to go get some slugs. So we're going to go on the way back. We'll try and get that slug we saw a minute ago uh, without driving into the chasm. All right, so we've just got to fill that gap over there and then we're almost done. We've almost got the link uh, completed which is very nice and then we can head back over to the main production area in the next episode and we can start setting up all of our mega production all right so there's a slug there so let's go grab that one all right a bit of jumping around to do now we've got to run and jump over to there oh that's all right we made it first time that time Okay, so we're going to grab the green power slug there. Got him. And then we need to grab... Where was the other one? There's one over there. Right, need to go grab that one. Is there any more? Probably wouldn't hurt us... There's one over there too. Probably wouldn't hurt us to grab the... Uh, or to do the um, scanner to find the bugs. And we'll probably do that a little bit later on. That's one of the milestones we can do. But we won't do that right now. Go grab this other one here. And then on the... So it is on the way back to the base, after all. So, we just have to worry about this um, plant here. Now, see if we can do a run and jump and then get up there. Nope, it's not being very helpful. Right, not very helpful at all. Okay, what we can do is we can do it the cheaty, cheaty way. What's the cheaty, cheaty way? Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to get a foundation. And we're going to build a foundation. Like so. And then... I wish there was some way you could just actually do the raise and lower of those foundations. But anyway, it is what it is. Like that. And put another one in here. Really, it's no it's no real loss doing it this way. It's just we're gonna get the all the foundations back. Um, it's just the time it takes. Oops, so I can't make it yet. See, white men can't jump. Right, so put another foundation in over there. Right, now I shouldn't have to jump. I should be able to just mosey on up. And there we go. Another green spout, power slug. Right, now let's come back down here. And we'll just remove it all. Nothing to see here. All done. Well, no, not quite all done. Right, now he's done. So, back into the tractor and over to the base. So, this is, uh, there's a bird's eye view of what we've done there. So, uh, that production facility is coming through, which is good. Got plenty of room to get around and under with the tractor and it comes across so there's all our concrete so we've got plenty of concrete concrete coming out the yin yang i don't think we're going to ever need to get any more limestone running um and then all we got to do is bring that over here and we can tie that in to the system over here now currently as well our copper and our wire stops here so if i come in here there's all our copper and our wires and like one up there as well so that stops there as well so what we need to do is that needs to also get over to our distribution system which is way over here now to finish off the episode one of the things we tried to do is we tried to get this working now we're having no end of trouble but of getting our foundations attached 
and that wants to work now. So I don't know what it was, but every time we went to do something, it came up with a with an error, right? So we just want to make sure, is this the height that we can go? And it is. So this is the height we want to go to get above all of our factory here, okay? So what we can do is we can basically encase this mess, and I, I use that literally and figuratively, um, we can use this to cover up our mess. Or well, maybe not. Oh, why does it do this? This is exactly what it did last time. Alright. No, I've got it back. I know what it was. I know what's caused it now. That's okay. I can fix that. All right, oops. So we can encase it all, and then we can build on the second level. Now, I know my building technique is nowhere near as uh, beautiful as many others, but uh, we can fix that eventually. There we have it, right, so now, this is our entrance here, so what we're going to do is we're going to put a wall in here. So wall, and then we're going to put this here. Can't afford. Right, so we haven't got any steel plate. Right, let's go fix that problem. Steel plate. We need steel plate. Where have we got an abundance of steel plate? Uh, probably over here. How much have we got in here? we got plenty. So we need to get some steel plate. And we need to get some steel rods. Steel rods are coming out through there and into this one here. So we've got some steel rods. Right, now, that should give us more than enough to get our um, stuff up and running. Now, uh, what we'll do is we'll actually we'll just finish that. We'll put this in here. Just to get a bit of a feel for what we're going to do. A gate, another gate there. No, we can't put a gate there because we haven't got a ramp. We've got a ramp, but we haven't got, we've got this in the way. So we've got to fix it all up. So what you can do is, as you would have seen, we can put all sorts of different walls down. So we can put walls that have a conveyor uh, coming through. So for instance, you could do that. And then you can actually bring your conveyors in through the wall, right? Very handy, very nice, but we haven't played with that at all. So... Uh, We'll have to look at that a little bit later in the future episode, but that's basically what we're going to do. We're going to start encasing this sort of area. Um, we need to have a way of getting up there, and we can do that via the stairs. So the stairs are, I think, under no logistics, no walls. Where are they? Where are the stairs gone? There they are. Stairs right. Okay. So we can put this... Uh, there, no, we want to go. It has to be on a, a slab, I think. Yes, it has to be on a slab. So what we need to do is we need to put a foundation down first. Put a foundation. They can't put a foundation there either. All right, so it's time. Let's not forget about this. Okay. <sighs> Frustrating. All right, let's have a look over here. Let's let's see what we can do on the way of research. We've got anything in here. We haven't done any research for ages. Right, so let's configure the man. What can we do? Quick wire, fabric, hard drive, purple power slug. Uh, let's do a purple power slug. Right, analysis underway. Right, do something useful with our time. In here, what have we got in here? Whoa. Oh, I pressed F, that's why. So we've got lots of stuff in here. What have we got? We got some, oh, we got some power slugs. Look at that. Look how many power slugs we've got. All right, let's make use of those. We're gonna to need to ramp up our gear. So well, let's just make some power shards. So, there we go, put those there, and oh, look at them all. We got plenty of them, we got millions. All right, I'm getting too excited. There we go, so we got power shards available. Right, all good. Now, as I was saying before, we need to get a set of conveyors over here through all this mess up over the top into our other area 
So I'm thinking what we might do, even though that might be the building through there, if we put some foundations on the outside here, and that's where we end up taking the conveyors. So they'll come up on this slab here and then be distributed out. So we're going to get one of those there like that, and we can't quite do it. Now, I do need to get up to that height and finish that off. So, we are going to have to find a place where we can put a slab and get that height. And that's most likely going to be here. So, put a foundation there. Then we're going to put three walls. So I think that was the height we had. So we're going to put one, two... Oh, we have enough concrete. All that concrete we've got. Do we have enough concrete? Oh my goodness. Turning into a mess. I apologise. This is one big mess today. We're all over the shop. We've got plenty of concrete over here though. There we go. Get some concrete. Right. Take a cup of concrete. Harden up. Right. Over we go. In we go. Oh, all this mess. All this mess. Right. Over. Well, well, where are we? Here, there, here. Right. Wall. Wall and wall. Right. Now, foundation. We'll go there and there. What I want to do here, can't do it there. I can do it here. Right. Do that there. Stairs. Stairs up. Now like that. Up. And then up. And then up. Oh. Foundation is in the way. Right. Up there like that. And we are almost at the height we need to. So we're just going to put another set of stairs there. Alright, that gets us up to that level. Marvellous. Now, we just need to build our foundation across. Like so. It's going to be a big monster, isn't it? Okay, so there we go. So that's the extent of where our... We want our um, conveyor belt to run. Fill in those gaps. Right, so that's what we want to do. So we're going to bring the conveyors over through here. And then they're going to go join up in those stacks over there. So, what we'll do is we'll just get this. Now, I don't know how many we're going to need yet, but we're going to put one two up there so we're not going to have any walls on this upper level that's what I've decided right now took me so long to decide that two one two then we're going to hook most of this up off camera because it's been a pretty boring episode I think so far if it hasn't let me know in the comments if it has let me know in the comments as well I'll know not to do it again but you need to see what we do behind the scenes, I guess, as well. And it is all part and parcel of the game. Now, I am just going to put another one. I can't afford that one, so I'm not going to put another one there. All right. So that's what we're going to do. So we're going to bring those conveyors way over there in the distance. Way, way over there in the distance. They're going to come over through here, probably over this line through here. Pick up the ones from the copper. They're going to come up here, connect into here. We're going to come across the outside of the building, effectively. Round the corner through there. Then you're going to come down, tie into the distribution center over here, and then over here is where we're going to start building all of our stuff and really sort of getting production up and running. So let's see how much how well that works. 
These rotors here will be fed back up into the distribution system as well, and we'll get them running. Uh, we've got the screws going across. We've got plenty of concrete lined up there. It's all looking quite good, although this is a mess down here. And I think we probably could tidy this up. Just a matter of spending the time. And certainly once we get um, the new storage containers, uh, it will make it a lot easier as well. So we will probably look at redoing this area through here, um, but certainly not right this minute. Okay. Anyway, that is it for this episode. And again, I apologize if it did seem very disjointed, but um, yeah, we're all over the shop a bit today. That's okay. We'll uh, try and make amends. Thanks very much for watching. If you like the episode, make sure you press that like button. If you're not already a subscriber to the channel, please subscribe as we try and get to our thousand subs. Um, oh, a bit of a stretch. And that's it for today. So, no matter whether it's morning, afternoon, evening or night, no matter around the world, take care of yourselves and your loved ones. And we'll see you again very, very soon back here at Satisfactory. See you all later. Bye.